AJ Mirwald, bringing you another episode of Science and Sailors. Today, we'll be demonstrating a system that has been used for centuries to make work on a boat easier. We call this system a block and tackle, which you may be more familiar with the word pulley. A block and tackle makes it much easier to move very heavy objects using mechanical advantage. For example, if this bucket weighed 100 pounds, we could use a simple block and tackle system like this one, which is a 2 to 1, and I would only have to apply 50 pounds to pick up the 100 pounds. Now if we used a slightly more complicated block and tackle system, like this one over here, which is a 3 to 1, then I would only have to apply a little over 33 pounds to pick up a 100 pound bucket. In exchange for the reduced amount of force we need to use, we have to pull the rope much farther to move the load the same distance. So there's a compromise. Using the more complicated system, this one, we would have to pull the rope three times farther than if we were not using the block and tackle system at all. And this one, we would pull it twice as far. To really drive this point home, we've rigged up a tug of war system. Let's see how two of our larger sailors can compete with one of our smallest sailors, Allie. Now our larger sailors, myself and Ethan, will be on the harder side that's not using the mechanical advantage of the block and tackle system. As you can see, mechanical advantage makes a big difference. Also, Allie's just very, very strong. <laughs> now, depending how you arrange that system, it can be a four to one or a five to one black, b block and tackle system, making Allie four to five times stronger than she is without it. So we use this system on a boat, not only to set her heavy sails, but for a ton of other purposes as well. Can you think of any other ways that we can use systems like these? How could you use this system to make tasks easier in your own life? Share in the comment section below. And this has been Josh with Science and Sailors bringing the Bayshore to you.